New at 9, M1 Bank is celebrating the grand opening of its national headquarters in Clayton with a unique event centered on community outreach. Fox News Taylor Harris is live at M1 Bank headquarters. And Taylor, what makes this night so special? Shirley Jasmine, what truly sets this evening apart is the focus on giving back as the guests explored the state of the art building. They visited the Giving Grove as an interactive space where donations to local and international charities were encouraged. One, two, three. With a cut of the ribbon, guests were invited to explore the Giving Grove, an initiative where attendees pick donation leaves to support local charities that were honored. Organizations like the Jackie Joyner Kersey Foundation and the Dred Scott Heritage Foundation and five others are highlighted as recipients and given an opportunity to impact lives. Our new project is possibly getting a new building downtown, the old Jefferson Bank, if we can, for his new Dred Scott International Center. The bank's commitment to community doesn't stop there. The attached free event space for charitable organizations will serve as a hub for partnerships and community events. Here at 7 North Bemiston, we created a non-for-profit event space um, right here in the heart of Clayton that any charity can use free of cost. And our heart behind this was to maximize they're giving. To cap off the evening, Ferguson native Brian Owens premiered his latest film, which chronicles the inspiring journey of N1 Bank CEO and his wife, showing how faith and dedication led them from starting the bank in 2017 to tonight's grand opening. On the local level, we support nonprofits, and on the national level, we support community solar developments and affordable housing. With three locations and growing, M1's bank's first brick and mortar headquarters is now more than just a bank. It's a beacon of community empowerment, standing tall with a mission that stretches across 35 states. Reporting in Clayton, Taylor Harris, Fox 2 News.